So crypto god John, he's famous for turning just $3,000 into millions using small micro cap crypto tokens. And although we missed that first opportunity to ride that wave with him, he says he plans to do it all again by buying right now. He recently tweeted, aped a bunch of money into low caps this weekend. Plan is to hold for the next 16 to 24 months or until they 100X or go to zero. And naturally, this intrigued me because I personally would love to know exactly what tokens he's buying because he even announced that he has a new number one favorite altcoin whose token just got released. He tweeted, Redacted is now my biggest altcoin back that I think can do a 50 to 100x. Well, we sniffed around and found out that he's referring to this AI based altcoin. We also investigated his wallet and his socials to find out exactly what he's holding and buying into right now to bring you this list. So if that excites you, please hit that like button down below for me. Put on your crypto god Benji hat and let's jump in. Awesome. So we have three tokens in this episode for you. Now, please be aware that I'm not personally a fan of all three of these tokens. These are the tokens that we found crypto god John to be holding or buying or telling us that he's buying right now. And on to the list. So the first token in this list is probably one that you've heard of before. And you'd probably be less surprised to know that crypto god John holds this token in his wallet. And the project is called Compete with a K. Now, we first came across Compete last year in July when Alex Becker put out one of his tweets asking for altcoin recommendation. And this is when Crypto God John came into the thread and recommended a really small micro cap token called Compete that was trading at just a quarter of a cent at that time. The Compete project is a team-based multiplayer gaming verse where you can create your own competitor, adjust attributes, style in your playstyle, and squad up with the homies to compete in some of the best multiplayer game modes of all time. They currently have a battle royale, a kart race, golf, and basketball with more game modes coming soon. Compete has really awesome graphics, a play to own infrastructure, and a CEO who is an ex-pro gamer himself. But back to Alex Becker's tweet thread because Alex saw Crypto God John's tweet, actually liked it, which that one click of a mouse skyrocketed the Compete token 300% to almost one cent. And right now the Compete token has a lovely shape looking graph with a fully diluted market cap of 17.5 million and a price just under two cents. It has a decent amount of trading volume on decentralized exchanges, which is always good to see. And yes, it would have been way better for you to get into Compete when we first talked about it on our channel at half a cent. But Crypto God John still thinks this must be a good token to hold. And how do we know this? Because he's still holding it himself. Now, buckle up, settle in. This second token is a doozy. It's one that's actually really interesting and it's the one that Crypto God John referred to as his biggest altcoin bag right now. It's also AI based, which is a fantastic narrative and the token's only been out for 13 days. But as you saw at the start of the video, Crypto God John didn't disclose what this token was in his tweet. He used this word redacted to censor the token's name. Now, naturally people in the comment section of this tweet were trying to guess which token it was that Crypto God John is actually referring to. But here at Across the Rubicon, we're commonly referred to as the people's champion of the blockchain. I do have to insist that you guys stop spamming our comments with that. We don't deserve such an honor, but we try our best. But we really do like to go to that next level on behalf of you guys, our subscribers. We threw on our search and rescue gear and dived into the digital blockchain ocean to reverse engineer Crypto God John's tweets and social interactions so we could find out exactly what this redacted coin is. And we came across this. Four days ago, Crypto God John picked up a few thousand dollars of this token. It's called Actus with a Q. And when trying to work out if this is the token that Crypto God John is referring to in his redacted tweet, we actually saw that Crypto God John is a little bit of a wise guy, a class clown of sort, because their token reserve is actually called redacted. And before I tell you what this token actually does, if you like having this sort of inside information on popular crypto influencers like Crypto God John or Alex Becker, Ilya Trades, or even Gary Vee, you're going to absolutely love our Patreon because we have software and tools in there that send you real time alert when these massive crypto influencers buy a token or an NFT project that gives you the time to research it on your own before they post about it to their millions of followers. We also built up an Alex Becker portfolio tracker where we take all of his decentralized wallets across all the popular chains and compile it into one really easy to understand dashboard that updates daily so you know exactly what Alex Beck is holding at all time. We're also continuing to create more crypto cheat sheets, rising token breakdowns, and awesome tools to empower you with a competitive edge. So if you'd like to actually get ahead of the mainstream and join the masters of the blockchain revolution, I highly recommend clicking the link in the description below. That'll take you into an application that'll take you to the Patreon page where you can sign up and get instant access to all of this. And if you don't want any of this, I hope 
hope you keep enjoying the free stuff, but please know if you've been on the fence for a while, we are putting our prices up at the end of this month, actually. This will be the fourth time we do put our prices up as we offer more and more. So make sure you do sign up now if you're planning to sign up in the future so you can grandfather yourself into the cheaper price point. And now back to Actus. They are an AI powered quant DeFi tool that analyzes public perception, news and social sentiment to calculate how it may impact the financial markets which is precisely the narrative-based trading that we love. They look to have a well-qualified team. Their coder has 20 years of experience working for Vodafone and the Dutch police force. Their chief quant has an MBA in AI and machine learning and has worked for Santander Bank. And the CEO was an early investor in both ThorChain and Chainlink and has been working with his team on Actus now for over 12 months. And if you wanna go a level deeper on what this project actually does, we're gonna release the full breakdown on this project to all of our awesome Patreons this week. In terms of tokenomics, before before I get into exactly what it is, know that this is a crazy risky play. They don't have a product out there right now. They're still building up their team and it's entirely speculative. Even crypto god John recognizes that all of these old coins can go to zero. But on the other side, they could also 100x. And it's that sort of asymmetric risk reward that people like crypto god John invest in these tokens for. And Actus currently have a $3.8 million fully diluted market cap. And according to their tokenomics, that's about two thirds diluted, giving them a circulating supply of 2.6. Million. But please do double check these numbers for yourself. As I said, this token is only 13 days old and it's still in its infant stage and all the data is still coming out. Which takes us to our third token. And this is one that Crypto God John is very publicly bullish about. It's called OXO.AI. And they describe themselves as an all-in-one privacy hub and AI smart contract auditor with 100% of utility income distributed back to OXO holders in creating a passive income. OXO uses machine learning to analyze code for vulnerabilities, errors and issues. The state-of-the-art technology generates comprehensive reports that details any issues found and suggestions for how to fix it. They plan to have their product work in a three-step process. One, it'll analyze the code of any smart contract for vulnerabilities and errors. Two, it uses machine learning algorithms to identify patterns that could indicate potential issues. And then three, it generates a report detailing any issues found and suggestions on how to fix them before the developer deploys it onto the blockchain. Two of the features I found most interesting with this project are one, it's anonymous transaction functionality, where users are able to send tokens or ETH to someone completely anonymously. And two, an AI bot that OXO plans to introduce is one that will front run any weird transactions such as setting tax too high or removing liquidity, which will protect users from getting rug pulled, which of course is a common tactic used by scammers in the DeFi space. I see this as almost the web three version of trying to unsend an email. We can get those Gmail plugins that will hold your sent emails for say 30 minutes. So you can actually cancel the send at any time. Something like a little insurance policy for any shady transactions in web three. OXO is also a really new token and they have a fully diluted market cap of $17.1 million. And if you have any crypto god John information or recommendations, please comment them below and we'll research him on your behalf.